what is going on everyone this is Shipmas here and today we are going to be talking about iOS 7 and its battery life. So if you have already upgraded to iOS 7 developer build 1 or any of the developer builds you have probably noticed that your battery life is draining more than it should and more than it was expected to with the developer build. And uh, basically it's pretty much eating the battery life, your phone might be getting warm and so on. So uh, there's no real solution to getting your battery life more in iOS 7 other than uh, cutting up off on some uh, expenses. And so uh, what we can do right now is shut down some of the things and make the battery life go more. So a few things I'm gonna be mentioning in this video if you do those things uh, your battery life might just get a little bit more. It might give you an hour or two more than uh, the previous uh, things that were running on it. So let's go ahead and check it out. So one of the first things you can do is go ahead into your settings and once you're in the settings go to cellular and turn off 3G. Now I pretty much keep my 3G off because most of the times when my 3G is on the battery life drains twice as fast. So if you turn off 3G, LTE or whatever network you're on it might save you a little bit of battery time. For more battery life you can pretty much turn off your cellular data and that might actually help a lot compared to 3G as well. The other thing you can do is go ahead go into your settings go to general and go to the option named as background app refresh. Now Apple has a background app refresh state in which it will update all the apps which require a background app like weather, stocks or your magazines and so you can turn that off and save some of the battery life. Just go ahead into that and turn off like I have here and it might actually save you a pretty much amount of battery life because uh, most of the apps do not refresh while they are at the back so if you don't want the weather to refresh or the stocks to refresh or you don't really use those apps so much this is a pretty good option for you compared to the cellular data option and the third and the final thing you can do to save your battery life is go to general and go to about scroll all the way down and you'll see diagnostics and usage go ahead and turn off diagnostics and usage so do not send the data automatically to Apple so this won't use your cellular data and thus will save your battery life so these are pretty much the three tricks you can apply to your phone on iOS 7 to save some of the battery life if you can. Well, thanks for watching the video. If you have any more tips and tricks to save battery life or anything about it, be sure to leave it in the comments down below and be sure to hit the like button if you like this video. Well, thanks for watching guys and if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel and stay tuned. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.